Hello everybody, I'm Peter Galop and today I'm making a video what would my gym be if I would, would get a chance to make a gym. Now first thing, I know this videos will be coming out before Sun and Moon, but I just but this gym is gonna be in Kalos. Which isn't doesn't mean I'm low or something, but still you can technically make a video on what would kind of gyms would you do if you have a if you know you want to have if you prefer g want the gyms to have a lot, a lot of islands and make a video like that maybe I won't. But what I'm gonna make how my gym would be if I had a chance to make a gym in Calus. Now first thing, my gym would be an ice type gym and it'll be the last one. So I would basically replace the the the, the gym either in Cal. That's already in Kalos, the ice. But it would be a different route. Now, my gym would be, as you can clearly see from this beacon picture, beacon school from Ubi. You really need to watch that. That's on Ubi's I decided to make it okay, look like a school gym. Which, I feel like it's a great way. I mean, you're a trainer who basically had no experience, I got this really experienced trainer. It would be great, and a great excuse why they would be a little more powerful than the rest ones, the other ones. Which I find really good. Good. Now, my trainers would basically be like students for Mistral, as you can see, see here in this picture. Yeah, there would be a couple of students, and he's Three three weak weak ones, and one puff, and one more puff. Now, what I mean with that is, and then to answer answer the, those rooms that you can, but they are essential for you to go to get to me, which I'll be in the, which I'll get to later how it'll be. You have to beat them. The weakest weakest ones will be the ones. With, with a low level pix. And before you say, a low level pix is just Volpix will make sense because they would be con my school would be connected to a, a low level island. So a low level pix does make sense what to be. Hell, it could be actually kind of hinting at that. Like, once you defeat those weakest ones, trainers, they'll say, tell you something about a low level islands. Now the more powerful ones will have Rotom um, refrigerator because it's a pretty because they will have electric fight, which will make a lot more harder for your water types, and it would be go good to have a, a Pokemon that can do something against a fire type and not just be per and the weaker. Okay, and the strongest ones would we have a bird your mind sorry if I pronounce it wrong who would basically be like almost evolved I mean just one basically one more battle and they'll ever evolve be but not really these ones will be the ones that would who will be basically blocking the way you can go they're mostly gonna be teachers I feel like that would be a great way way and then, and then you will there will also be some students like at least one who be uh, telling you a little bit thing about me and my team, me and I types in a lot of region. And what they will be telling you is about is the fact that I am actually a white that I'm actually team. Fl I was one of the team flare people. Which is the reason why I would be in Kalos. I was like those, uh, I was like on those more icy fields. And basically like Giovanni from original. I found that was a cool concept. So my team would be of a balance now. Glaceon, Omega Glalie and... Crawlyogal, sorry my parents are wrong. And if you're going to be... And... And... As a special bonus, if you are going to be defeating every single Alola 
bull pigs, you will also have a chance to fight my Alola La Ninetales. Now the way how you are going to get is that I'm gonna be in the top of the tower. After you basically beat the bad teacher there, I'll be you'll be entering an elevator. Where the best teacher is gonna be mentioned a little bit how how I operate and stuff and other things. Like how I'm literally believed not to be the I'm literally like inhuman. Which is the reason why the, because I constantly have a sword why I constantly have a sword with me, why I wear a mask and all those stuff. Now what and basically everything. Then when you arrive, I'll be sitting in the chair, act looking like I'm not, I'm not even paying attention. Like it's another school, or another with ridiculous school problem. Then when he says headmaster, to the trainer that a trainer has come to challenge you for the, for the gym badge. And I'll be like, so, and I'll, before I go to battle, I'll be asking you, have you heard, I'll be asking you, have, how was a lot of Vulpix in battles, which would you only know because these, every single one would like, tell you a little bit about them, like what kind of moves they do and what kind of stats. And all those stuff, and all those kind of things. Then, if you answer all the questions, and he's, you know, somewhat correctly, I'll be using my, a lot of nine tails first. Then I will, but before the battles, I'll be also asking about Team Flare, and what my role was basically. But then I say. Let's not focus on the past. You're here for my gym, for the gym battle. And like I said, like I always said, my g a lot of nine tails will be a special fixture if you want to use. I find it will be a great concept for a g final gym. If you wanna have a defeat, fight me full power, you have to have um, you're going to have to learn something about the nine tails. I mean, I figured if you're gonna go to a lot of school, at least learn a school, at least, you know, learn, need to learn something, some kind of reward, not just go out, have I an mean, interesting fun, blah, 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 and that. But the other way, I'll be using Clarion for my press. Is it going to be Nine Tales or Glacian? Glacian, or Glorion, whatever this snowflake is. The next battle Pokemon I'll be using is Obama Snow. And the final one would be Glaceon. No, I mean before Ome Glele. I will battle the But bef Then I immediately evolve him into Mega Glele. Le and then And after that but the difference will be that in this gym I'll be way overpowered. Like, lev I'll be basically more powerful than it. I'll be basically at power of the elite four, even more powerful than some of them. I feel like that'll be a good. So you're going to have to to you will technically kind of lose the first match because also you can't find a way how you can basically like win every single gym badge. I mean immediately. So yes, I'll be basically like elite four level. I mean maybe it'll be a the the behind but not that much. Then the end I would basically then when you lose because I would be more powerful because my problem would be incredibly more powerful than yours. But oh anyway, if well my team will will be able to beat me the second time. I will say how you battle incredibly. It's been a long time since a battle fighter beat me. Me. And you'll be 
but you came a bit close to beat me. But explains, you're welcome to stay in my school until you base. You're welcome to stay in my school for the training and everything. Me, when you want. You can come, you can either go outside you can either go back to wild train or you can stay at the school and train. Wait my my students. I'll say anything. Anything important. Then you you will probably choose then it's more likely that you're going to choose that you're gonna stay there and and stay. I'll be then you'll be meaning a room partner, which is basically a f so then you're going to have a chance to to stay in the room. Then for a few times you're going to basically be basically you're going to be there for three days, and in the meantime you won't be just you know in tasks and that you will actually be training. You're going to be fighting. Uh, you'll be sent. You're basically going to have like Rube. You're gonna to go to village with your roommates. Which will be just whatever you pick. It can be be seriously whatever. You can have a boy or girl. They will basically have similar team as me. I mean just a lot of nine tails, Eevee, and yeah. They have Glaceon and all the la, 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 uh, nine ta tails, tails, no. And after the three days, they are basically just going to be sent to new missions to help people. People's, pull. You're gonna be deciding to either go there and battle me again, or you're gonna take another three days. I'm guessing you'll be, be. No matter what you choose, you will be able to. I will be in the second round weaker because of some kind of a big thing that happened like my gla in the next team team I won't use a lot of nine tails because it ha was based on one of the missions that I had to go so uh, my team so my team will be definitely so you are going to be a 50 50 chance to go with a lot of nine tails because it will be basically helping some of our EV train uh a lot of Volpex trailers. I will also not be have with my Glacier because well gla because well any a teach junior to show up uh, want to show the evolutions. So you gonna be basically battling my mammoth mine Grace, Crolion, and Glele. You in after that you basically are gonna be able to defeat me, and when I end this, I'll be basically saying that day I saw you, I knew you were a powerful trainer, and I'll basically give you like this badge that basically is just Team Flare symbol in blue. If you have. And then I would say, if you ever need my help, contact me. Or contact anyone. My school is always open. And I'm also going to give you a chance to c c stay in school and train a little bit so you become more powerful before you go challenge Elite Four. Now, I don't know if I'm gonna stay with this. Now, this is basically what my gym is gonna be. My gym is basically going to be like a school gym. I hope you, you're going to like this video. I hope you're going to leave a subs. You're gonna leave. You're gonna subscribe me for more videos in the future. And I do have a bunch of videos to plan. But if you actually have a video that you want me, me to cover, me to cover or something, please leave it in the comments. I read them always. And now, see you until next time. No, see you next time. See ya.